Coming at you live from Detroit, Michigan. Live. This is Not, Not the, the Lions. Lions. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, folks. Wherever you stood, stand, and watching us, we are live. We are not podcast. We ain't pre-recorded. This, this is, is not live. a podcast. This is live from Detroit, Michigan. Just like Saturday night in New York and all this. This is Detroit, Michigan. Ford. So we- welcome to Detroit. Detroit. Ah, thirty-one ah. to twenty-seven. Thirty-one to twenty-seven. Miami thirty-one. Detroit Lions twenty-seven. Hey, I gotta ask. You know I'm gonna ask. When y'all was at home, y'all sat there eating your hot dogs, drinking your beer. Oh, yeah, yeah. Giving guys high fives. Y'all really thought they was going to win, didn't you? I got two quick questions off the top of the show. Being not a fan of football, what is a false start? Somebody call in and tell me what a false start is or write to the email (laughs) something. What's a false start? Why do we have the most in the whole NFL? The most. What does that mean? Why do we get like 10, 10 a game or something? I don't know. If you guys had – They say that's significant. Why? You you know what this show is And why about. is the Lions getting it with no Ws? So, we're going to say, hey, we was up. As usual, you know, let me, let me explain something. I don't always bash – all NFL teams or any particular NFL team. But let's 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 hit facts. If you got a lead, a double lead, you should be able to hold on to that lead. Not let somebody not only catch up to you, tie you, pass you, and further on get to where you can't even touch them. Something is wrong. Something is very wrong. This you guys are putting up high school points. Let me say that again. You are putting up high school points. You are getting paid hundreds and thousands, some of you millions, to do nothing. You're making us look bad. I'm not gonna even say all that. All I'm gonna say is in 2014, the Lions were six and two at this point. Ooh. They look real good. I can only say thank you, Mitchell and Williams, for bringing the Detroit Lions their first touchdown since Seattle. Hey, guys. (laughs) Thank you, you guys. (laughs) Thank you. Now, we need more of that. Detroit pride somewhere. When you put that blue jersey on, that Lions helmet on both sides, and you snug it tight and you snap your little um, thingy, Bro, <laughs> get some fire. Have some pride. I got to tell you, we should change the color. Maybe we should get another team, like California or Texas. They Don't they got two or three teams? We, You know what? Don't they got two or three teams? Yes, they do. We could have another team. We could have a couple other teams. I mean. Share the stadium. I like Detroit. I, I mean, I grew up. As a fan of the Detroit Lions, whoever don't know me, I grew up the biggest Detroit Lions fans there is. But now, after all these years, and I'll say it again, I'm a grandfather now. I would not be sucked in to the Lions crap. (laughs) Defense, offense, lose, no W's. No, it's been decades. We got to have a W. Now, again. Decades. You give us a call at 313-868-4336. Decades mean 10-year spans upon 10-year spans upon 10-year spans. And it's been like six of them. Seven. But who's counting? All you really have to do, I'm going to tell you, Alliance organization, listen. Listen to me. Listen. Give Bobby Lane his proper due. His aura hovers over Ford Field. It hovers. You keep losing. All you got to do is give Bobby Lane, the champion, the GOAT of all Lions organizations, 
He did it. Give him his props, and you will get a W. That's all you got to do. Sounds That's the simple. key Sounds fair. to good luck for the Detroit Lions. Or they, my opinion. Or they could go back to the like the Fred Flintstone days and start exercising with your shoes off, get some of that rubbish under your feet. I think we we need we need a new turf. I don't think we need a dome. I think we need to tear that dome off, get these guys some light. They 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 too much in the dark. Maybe that's the reason why we can't play. They can't see. Give give some light up. Forefield to me has nothing to do with it. Oh, I'm putting These everything guys out there. Need to play some defense. <laughs> now, okay, now you need to play some defense. The offense needs to play some defense. Everybody should walk <laughs> in the door, uh, play uh, defense. Get get the defense, water boy defense. to play some defense. The cheerleaders should be playing defense. Everybody should be playing defense. Protect the home turf. Protect the blue and silver. But you don't. You be like went by me what should I do now coach you didn't tell us about this that's what it looks like on live TV while you getting paid hundreds of thousands of dollars have you ever noticed when they have it on the on the slow-mo and they have the guys going up in the air and the ball just goes over his head and under the helmet you can hear him saying ninja and look at the the quarterback like did you not see what we talked about you were supposed to gave it to me and catch it right in my hand. I was supposed to catch it. What happened? Quarterbacks, you have a job. When you get in that huddle, you get that play, you tell your guys, hey, I want you to go down the middle, do a quick dab, and I'm going to throw the ball directly to you. All you have to do is run, quick dab, turn around, pocket. But but it's not his fault if the line is not doing their job. Your line has to be able to stop the opponent from breaking through so your captain, who is the quarterback, can do that play. Can do that play. The line has to hold. I don't know what kind of football you guys been watching, but the football that I've been watching since I was a little kid you hold the line. You hold the line. You do not let that line break. You Your do only job you is to hold that line so the play can resume. Can The play can happen. So the play can be a play. You got one job. That is to hold that line. And don't get penalties. Don't <laughs> get flags. Lions flag. Lions flag. Penalty. Those 25 yards. Lions. When you lose yardage, that hurts. When you fumble, that definitely hurts. Especially when you fumble and you in state turf. I give props to the field goal kicker for making the field goals last last game. I got to give props to him. I don't know your name, but good job this time. We making progression. I ain't trying to be funny. Do you know any of the players' names? Um, I just gave props to the, the Williams guys, the people who just got the touchdown. See? Thank you again. But we need more. It's not just you guys. Everybody need to step up. That one guy, Williams, it was his first uh, his first NFL completion. Thank goodness somebody is picking some right people. Brad, you're doing a little bit. Who said it was him? Mm. <laughs> I'm just giving props to Brad because that's the only name. We don't know. He That, that player might have said, hey, I take the penalty and do this play myself. Sometimes you may have to do what you have to do. Now, it's easy for us to sit at home and say this and say that. The whole purpose is you guys did not get a W. No W. I don't Close. care how you Close, do it. Close, but no cigar. We need that W. We need that it's W. It's getting closer and closer we and closer. We need one W, then we need two Ws. Then we need three Ws. Then we need four Ws. Get that momentum but going. It's not me. Shut I really don't care because I'm a not the Lions fan. But act like a Latino here. You better get some of that flame of the finger. You got it. You you better get angry. I don't care. You but you want to know how you play the game? Act like somebody talking about your mama. Act like somebody hit your pinky toe and get fired up. You gotta get fired up. You guys 
are not acting like lions. You're acting like pups. There has to be a push somewhere. You got to have an inner roar as, as a football player. You cannot let this guy run past you. You cannot let this guy uh, grab, catch the ball, grab his arm, something. Be successful. Successful is the key. Now, Bobby Lane implemented winning. What are you doing? You're not focused on the W. The W is sleep, locker room, weight room, tunnel, helmet. Field, W, scoreboard, W. And even after him, we have Matthew that used to be there, and he gave you the taste of victory as well. So it's there. We could keep saying about the curse. Maybe, hey. You the curse invokes winning. The curse invokes giving proper due to the greatest players in the history of Detroit football, these people, and in the history of the NFL. Step up. Get these guys their props. Step up. They won't make these curses. You'll get the W's. You'll get something. Something. <laughs> Something's better than nothing. I even go, we went last year with a tie game. Tie means you was good enough. Not to lose, but you wasn't good enough to win. That's in between. But it's better than just completely losing. Way better than completely losing. You guys need to see how your fans look when you guys lose. Do you even think about the fans? I I had to figure that at this point. I'm like, are they even thinking about the fans in their fancy cars, in their fancy housing, with their fancy lives? Without the fans, <laughs> are they what? fancy? Are they just like regular people? I don't know. I'm not really a fan. I'm, I don't know who draft. I don't know the names. I, I just know the L's. No, the that. L's add up. The L's is larger in the organization than the W's, and that is a problem in itself. Not cool, fellas. Not cool. In history, in, in the books. history. In the book, six hundred and something to five hundred and something. Don't you feel the burn? I cry. I cry just thinking about it. It hurts me. Now I'm gonna tell you, Henry Ford happens to be one of my heroes. Henry Ford walked from Dearborn to Jefferson in Detroit daily. That That's a real man. <laughs> that speaks volumes. That is a determined man. So his organization, the things he accomplished around the world, does not represent the L. Mm-mm. You guys got to You got to step up. We have basketball. <laughs> they respect the bad boys. The bad boys too. Same old last year Lions. You got hockey. Hockey has won, won Stanley Cups up in the time. Tigers did their thing. When it comes to the Lions, it's like the level just went decline. Worst defense in all of football. It ain't no defense. If you guys had defense, the other team won't score. It's that simple. Our offense, we got all right. We scored this week. Three cornerbacks short. No safeties. The safety is there, but it seemed like they're not there. Touchdown of the team. We need (laughs) some fire. I could bring three, four high school kids up there that do it just for the shine. You guys need to feel the burn on all the guys who are behind you that will beat you down for their job. You are not performing well enough to stay there. We are not happy as a city in your non-success. Keep it up. Keep it up. They would counsel. Miss Hempford, hear us out. Please. On the show, not the Lions. Please. We are losing again. It is not acceptable. 
as a city, do something. Kick somebody. Throw a garbage can, a piece of paper, something. Paper cut. Paper cut. We are a friend. Our franchise team. We are a proud city. This is a proud organization. Bobby Lane invoked winning. There's nothing wrong with that. He won the championship and you traded him to Cleveland. On the next episode, I'm going to find out which Ford performed this dubious deed and took us all down for 60-something years. Boo. Boo. It's not that hard. We say this on our show live all the time. We joke about it. We laugh about it. We cry about it. But the whole thing is we need to be successful. Every other team. We should not be the worst in our division, but we are the worst in our league. The whole league. Not just a division. If you was bad in the division, that would still be like, oh, okay. That's what I said last show. We just had like five, four and something, something. But now we are the worst in the whole league. Back to our original spot for years. What, 2014? I think. I yeah. Know. It's funny, though. If it wasn't for the one game, we would be looking at the same thing that happened in 08. When we were 0 16, the first team to ever not win a doggone game. One game. You could win that one NFL, game. NFL, uh, Detroit Lions fan, call in and tell me what you think. Call in and tell us how you think the Lions can do something this year. Tell us if you think they're going to do something next year. What was the stupid trade that they just did yesterday or something? Did, was it even significant or was it some more fluff? Like the paper towel in, in the section by uh, uh, in the family. Uh, all one. Is this some more fluff like Kleenex? Just to make us think that you're doing some moves. You're not. You're treating us like toilet paper. And you know what that is. It's so bad. You're making us look like a number two. With your fancy cars and your fancy living, you're, you're treating us so bad. Now see, They're so bad. This is the thing about this. This is what's going to be bad. You guys going to have a chance to actually make good draft picks, and you're going to mess up. Here we go with the draft picks. You're going to be able to get first pick here, second pick here. What you guys going to do, you're going to add up and say, hey, let's make a great idea. Wrong. Ding dong. Something up here just Fell right down the middle. No trades, just draft picks. We're a young team. You've been a young team for a decade. You had one, two players. Well, you know. Well, one, two players on defense, one, two players on offense. Now, nah, they tried a few years back. They're getting like five-year contracts. And they got. Production is one year. They got Six this, months. They got this one ten guy. Ten days. RB. I'm not going to put his whole name out there. But they put this man on the team because he had one of those. And they said, hey, if we could get this guy to tell us and show us how to get this. You cannot do that, idiots. Yes, I called you an idiot. One person with a championship ring is not a whole team. I heard the idea was to poach Match Patricia. How do you feel about that again? Let's, let's revisit the stupid Matt Patricia idea. How do you feel about poaching Matt Patricia? Matt Patricia. How do you feel about this guy? Did he really take you? Uh, did he take the organization to the heights that we thought they was going to take us? Defensive coordinator for the Patriots, not a coach. And where is he now? Where is he now? Where is he now? Where is Matt Patricia? Back in New England. Homie lover, homie lover, homie lover. Things happen for a reason, that's what they say. Hey, I don't know. We could get us a new quarterback. We have people say, hey, what if we could you let, oh, let's let's put it out there. Let's oh, we didn't even have good defense when he was the head coach. And he was a 
defensive coordinator. That should tell you something. Again, <laughs> is it the players? It could, man. It could be the. It could be the coach. Oh man. The and Lions, man, over the times and times and times, I almost got pulled in. I almost got pulled in. Oh, I, I, I had I to watch the game. I can't talk crap while I'm up here. I ain't watched the game. I had to watch the game. Watch the game. <laughs> Offense look good. Offense look all right. I don't think Jared Goff can take any hits. However, Ooh. Austin look good. Ooh. They held they held the line. But the defensive line, suspect. Suspect. Ooh, child. The defense is the foundation of the whole echelon. That defense. Line, that line gotta be gotta be strong. It gotta be strong. Play you know, some defense. Play some more defense and play some more defense. When you look out in the in the audience and you see them guys with the D's and they got the fence. That that's not for decoration. That's to tell you guys that you need to step up. Defense, put it together, get there out in that field, hurt them boys. Once again, hurt them. Once again, by the second half, they doubled down on stupid. No oh. defense. <laughs> There's the other team getting plays, getting completions. I think they'd be forgetting they're playing. I think they'd be still thinking they're in practice or something. I can't let them pull me in no more, man. They keep losing. They keep losing. They keep Parked losing constantly. 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 But, but see, everybody That's the like basis this. for this show. If you, as a fan, want to release all the anguish that these Detroit Lions bring upon your life, call into these numbers and say something. Give a comment, sponsor our show, give some type of mm -hmm. idea to the rest of the world that this is not cool. Your opinion does matter. Everybody, they're going to keep matters. doing the same thing, putting up all them L's. Speak up. Closeness. Speak up. L's. Preach. L's. Preach. This is not. Get it up. Lions. Out. L. We want the Lions. W. We want first downs. We want completions. We want some third and twos. We want to hear the man we say want some touchdown. field goals. We want to get inside oh, yeah. the Lions 20, 30, 40. Get field goal like Eddie Murray. And then when you start winning, maybe we can start seeing more people buying merchandise. Because what, what the people going to start And doing, loving their merchandise and not throwing it on the ground and going discount and don't be coming with no Christmas items, Christmas, the Lion's candles. Well, I, I want to burn a Lion's candle no, I, I'm, I'm to right represent right. the L's in my city. I may want to do that. I may want to burn a candle <laughs> to let them know how hot I am about not getting a W. This is crazy. Hey. It's about time to go knock on some doors down at Fort Field. I, I've been trying to not to – I tried not yeah, to, to even – We're going to go to Allen Park. We're going we're gonna to go up. No, I'm not going to practice. I'm going to the game facility place. They, don't, they act like they don't practice. They don't need to practice. Act like – even Ninja Turtles, they even practice. You got to practice. How you going to practice for a loss? Uh, you know what? They say when you're good at something, don't stop. <laughs> don't stop till you get enough like Michael Jackson. When you're uh, good at something, don't, don't stop. You guys good at losing. Like I said before, they never fail to fail. You can't even smile about this. We can't it continue. This the saga continues as the Lions fail and lose, and we're supposed to buy the merchandise and be happy, have a Lions Christmas Gotta have a lion's turkey first. This is the game that everybody Happy is, Thanks, it, no lions. This is the game everybody is concentrating on. Now we got oh, the cheese heads next game. The cheese heads. And they're winners. It's our division. If you guys ever, We <laughs> wanna beat Green Bay. 
We're going to see all that cheese running around downtown. There be so much cheese in there. I, oh, man. I'll be like a little mouse just up there. Nom, 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 nom. We are about to lose. All the green and gold. <sighs> will they prevail in the next game? Or will the Lions, the Honolulu Blue and the Silver, get the W? Will they? But it not do this. This is for the Lions. Oh, will we be here <laughs> again in shame, terrible again? Covering our faces so you can't see us. Because Lions. <laughs> get if game. I was a Lions fan, man, I just have a bag ready in the car or on the bike just in case. The W, it start happening in the second quarter like it's been happening in the second and the third quarter. Lions look so good, but the defense come out, you be like, ah, oh, maybe we can still pull it out. 29, 28, 20. L. First of all, the Lions look like little kids. <laughs> I'm not saying that. All I'm saying is L again. Terrible. One day, I know we're gonna get a W. Since I since you guys got fired contracts, I know people ain't getting fired or replaced. So what can I do? Just beg the players to dig down deep, go to family, no, go to uh five below and get them little step stools and step up. Exercise your right. Exercise a W. <laughs> We're going to try to get y'all mamas to start calling y'all before the game or something. Ooh. Somebody need to do something. Something that hasn't been tried because you guys, just look at the course. When you walk through the halls of Ford Field, I know you see the great pictures of the players before. I know you see the greatness. But I also know you see the banner. That Bobby Lane, the real giant Detroit echelon. It's there. Bobby Lane, number 22 retired. My man. He there. did it. The only other quarterback to get close was Eric Kramer. And then some argue Matthew Stafford. But I say Eric Kramer. Eric Kramer took us to the NFC Championship. So it was only Bobby Lane and Eric Kramer. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for joining us next time. Not the Lions. 11 a.m. Thursdays. Live. Live from Detroit. Stay tuned. Miami 31, Detroit 27. 27. L. See you guys. Cheese heads. Watch it. Thanks for joining us. Not the Lions. Thank you.